over the next few weeks, I'm going to be meeting people who have decided that the rat race just wasn't for them. And it starts right here in a woodland on the English and Welsh border. It's the sort of car that any secret agent would be proud to be seen in. This high speed amphibious sports car can swim, hover above water, and is certainly no slouch. Whether it's stress or a tragedy, their only option was to turn their back on the material world. The new Land Rover Defender, let's face it, it has been on everybody's lips. It's certainly been on mine. A few weeks back, I was invited down to have a sneaky, and I mean sneaky, I even had to squint just a little bit to have a look at it, and can reach 125 mile an hour on the road, 0 to 60 in 5.9 seconds, and an impressive 45 knots on the water. Riveted anymore, it doesn't leak water anymore. It's got too much of a posh bumper on it. It's too big, it's too much of the mum's school run. Well, some of that may be true, but I was pleasantly surprised. I'm at a secret location where behind these doors, they have made the new Land Rover Defender. Now, people are saying that it looks nothing like the old one. Well, I'm here to find out today. Is it going to be like the real Defender? Or is it going to be a pretender? Let's have a look. Yes, I'm Welsh. And yes, I'm in London. But I'm not on my own. I'm here with some fellow countrymen. And I'm going to meet them all at the Welsh Culture Centre where I can drink some Welsh beer. And even followed up by a Welsh whiskey chaser. Where we can talk about the green, green grass of home.